Hello, my name is Chet Napwaki. I am a voice engineer with 3Com Corporation. This presentation will cover a general overview of the 3Com NBX phone system. The 3Com NBX system was the first IP PBX to the market. The NBX was introduced over eight years ago in 1998. To date, there are well over 25,000 NBX installations worldwide. One of the main reasons for the success of the 3Com NBX phone system is the ease of installation and daily maintenance. The configuration and administration of the 3Com NBX system is completely browser based. There is a wide array of 3Com telephone options available as well. 3Com even has a phone option that allows gigabit ethernet to be delivered to the desktop through the gigabit switch ports in the phone. The 3Com NBX is a full featured PBX. Voicemail, auto attendance, hunt groups, voicemail to e email integration are just some of the embedded applications. The NBX system has an open architecture which allows for connecting additional 3Com and third party applications. The next section will cover the basic NBX hardware options. The NBX call processor is the main component of the system. This is the device that makes the call routing decisions. The NBX runs on VXWorks. This is an application specific real time operating system. This is a very stable and robust operating system that is used for other critical applications such as operating the Mars Land Rover and pacemakers. The NBX call processor includes four ports of voicemail and 400 hours of voicemail storage. There are two NBX call processor models, the V3000 and the V3001R redundant system. The main difference is that the V3000 is bundled with 15 phone device licenses and has built-in trunking ports while the V3001R redundant system does not but has hardware redundancy options. The NBX V3000 is a one rack unit device. It comes with four FXO trunk ports for POTS or analog trunk lines. This is the same type of phone line that you would have at home. The first FXO port has a PFT port, power fail transfer port. This allows for the first trunk line to connect to a standby analog phone in the event of a complete power outage. There is one FXS station port which is used to connect an analog phone or fax machine. The V3000 connects to the network with a 10100 Ethernet interface. The serial console port is used mainly for diagnostics. The music on hold input is a standard 3.5mm or 1 8 inch stereo jack. This can be connected to any device such as a CD player, MP3 player, or any other compatible device. There is also an external paging port. This is a 600 ohm dry contact port to connect to any standard typical overhead paging amplifier. The NBX V3001R redundant system is a three rack unit device. It has redundant features to allow for continuous operation. The V3001R call processor connects to the network with redundant 10100 Ethernet connections in an active standby configuration. The 3001R also has redundant load sharing hot swappable power supplies. The 3001R has an option to have mirrored hard drives as well. The serial port, the external paging port, and the music on hold port is the same as the V3000 call processor. The feature functionality between the V3000 and 3001R redundant system are identical. The NBX expansion chassis is used to expand the trunking capability of the NBX system. The NBX expansion chassis has redundant Ethernet interfaces that are used in an active standby mode. There are four module slots that are available which can be populated with different line cards. The NBX analog line card provides four FXO trunk ports for POTS or analog trunk lines. This card also includes a power fail transfer port. The NBX analog terminal card has four FXS station ports that can have analog phones or fax machines connected. The NBX digital line card has a digital port which can be software configured for either T1 or PRI functionality. The card also has LEDs to indicate the status of the circuit on the card. The Ethernet interface is generally used when the card is installed in the NBX100 chassis. 3Com offers a wide array of phone options. All the 3Com IP phones support the 802.3 AF power over Ethernet standard and have a large message waiting indicator lamp. Also, all the 3Com 3100 series phones offer a wide band audio support and are fully configurable through the web interface. 
The 3Com 3100 entry level phone is a single line IP phone. This phone does not have a display. The 3100 has four fixed configuration buttons. Many of the NBX advanced features can be activated by using feature codes. The 3100 has a single Ethernet connection. The 3Com 3101 basic phone comes in two models, either with a half duplex speakerphone or with a listen only speakerphone. The phone has a two line display and four programmable buttons. The 3101 phone has a 10100 switch built in. This allows for a PC to be connected through the switch port on the phone using only a single Ethernet connection. The 3102 business phone features a full duplex speakerphone and 18 programmable buttons. This phone also features a two line display. The 3102 phone has a built in amplified headset port as well. The 3102 phone has a 10100 switch built into it for PC connectivity. The 3103 manager phone has a gigabit Ethernet switch built in. This will allow the computer that is connected to the phone to run at full gigabit speeds if the closet switch is gigabit Ethernet capable. This phone has eight programmable buttons and a built in headset jack. The large display on the 3103 phone offers additional information to be displayed on the phone for the user. The phone also features dynamic soft keys which are located around the display to help navigate the phone and handle calls. The 3103 phone can show the status of up to three calls simultaneously. The soft keys located around the display can perform actions based upon the state of the phone call. In an idle state, the phone displays additional phone status information to the user. The 3105 attendant console has 50 programmable buttons that shift to 100 button functionality. The 3106 cordless phone connects to the network via a single 10100 Ethernet port. This phone operates on the 900 megahertz digital spread spectrum. The phone has its own power supply and does not utilize power over Ethernet. The range on the 3106 phone is up to 1000 feet. There are four programmable buttons on this phone. Up to 10 of these 3106 units can be deployed in a given area. The 3107 phone is similar to the 3106 except that it has a larger battery and a stronger transmitter. Up to three of these units can be deployed in a given area. The 3107 phone does not interfere with the 3106 phone and can be deployed in the same area. So a maximum of 10 3106 phones and three 3107 phones can be simultaneously deployed in the same area. The 3108 wireless phone is an 802.11 B&G compliant device. It interoperates with an IP telephony system using the Session Initiation Protocol or SIP. The 3108 phone will work with the NBX in release 6.0 and SIP mode. This phone has a small flip phone form factor. It also has a 1.8 inch color screen. The 3108 phone has advanced PBX features, selectable ringtones, programmable speed dial buttons, and a four way cursor control. The 3108 also supports wireless protected access 2 or WPA2 for, to ensure privacy. The analog terminal adapter or ATA has a single analog port that supports devices such as an analog phone or fax machine. The ATA has a built in two port switch to allow another device to be connected through the ATA unit. The unit can be powered by a local power supply or with industry standard 802.3 AF power over ethernet. The NBX solution can utilize analog polycom or any analog speaker phones. SIP based speaker phones can be used with the NBX in release 6.0 in SIP mode. The 3Com NBX system also supports PCX set. PCX set is the 3Com soft phone client for a Windows based PC. This is typically run on a laptop for a remote worker type scenario uh, with a dedicated connection or over a VPN type connection. The user would be placing and receiving calls uh, just as if they're in the home office. Now I will go over a typical deployment of an NBX system. First, there needs to be an Ethernet network switch. This switch can actually support power over Ethernet in order to power the phones. Next, we add the NBX call processor to the network. If needed, an NBX expansion chassis is added to the network to support either additional analog trunk lines or a digital T1 or PRI integration. Finally, phones are added to the system. The phone can, phones can be added as needed. 
Optionally, PCs can be connected through the phone switch port to have access to the network as well. I hope that this has provided for a helpful overview of the 3Com NBX solution. Thank you.